Welcome to MB Trading's online tutorial series. This presentation covers features related to stock trading with MB Trading. Before we get started, please take a few minutes to read through our legal disclosures on this slide. This presentation covers order entry using the MB Trading Desktop Pro platform for trading stocks. The following video will teach you how to place a threshold triggered order, otherwise known as a TTO, on the MBT Desktop Pro platform for trading stocks. A TTO order is used when you want to place a stop on one side of your trade and a take profit on the other. For example, you will first choose your stock symbol, then you will enter the number of shares, and you will enter into a trade. In this case, we're going to go long with a market order on Cisco. We're now ready to set up a TTO order. We have several ways that we can access the TTO screen. First, under the type dropdown, we can choose TTO, or we can right click on our order entry panel and choose template TTO. Again, the TTO allows us to set up a stop on one side of the trade and a take profit on the other. Since we're long, our first thing to do is to change our action to a sell. We then will change our take profit level. In this case, we'll make the take profit 19 and we'll make our stop loss 17. Now, if you noticed, it already had two different levels in the take profit and stop loss. You can actually customize your levels by right clicking, choosing preferences, and under the TTO offset prefill, you can enter in a fixed amount, in this case, a dollar amount, a percentage, or a percentage of your average true range. Once you've entered in your take profit and your stop loss, you will then click on submit and you will see them populate underneath your open orders. In this case, we have a sell on Cisco, 100 shares. We're either going to be stopped out at 17 a share or we're going to take a profit at 19 a share, whichever value comes first. You can adjust your TTO by right clicking and choosing change order. This allows you to make changes to your lower and upper trigger. You can cancel out your TTO by right clicking and selecting cancel and then choosing the specific order number. Or you can cancel out the order and close the trade by right clicking on your trade and selecting cancel and close Cisco in the account. You also can set up a TTO order on the short side. So if we were to short with a market order, we then would go back to our TTO screen. Our action would be to buy, and we would set up our upper and lower trigger. Again, the most important thing to remember about your TTO order is that whichever side of the trade gets hit first is where you will be taken out. So if your stock price gets hit, you'll be taken out there and it will cancel out your take profit. If your take profit is hit, it will hit there and then cancel that out your stop. In our next section, we will detail our combination orders.